All right, I got some vertical blinds that, whew, it's pretty obvious, is definitely sagging on the left side. Now, sometimes as long as these are mounted in the studs, what you can do is push up on the bracket itself on one side and maybe down on the other side. And this one, I only have so much room for the, for the wand. Let's see how close that is. A little something to work out there. I've got a half inch, so. Gotta tighten up that hinge on that right side. That should fix that squeaking door up. But what we've got to do is maybe lift this side up and push that side down. So let's start with this first. Feel for where the, oh gosh. It's not even in the, it's not in the stud. There it would be if it was mounted a little bit better. So I can actually take this out and mount it instead. And I'll rotate that <coughs> open. That straightened it up quite a bit, so what I got is my drill, and I just have a short drill bit, but what I'll do is use my my screwdriver, take my screwdriver off. It'll give me a, an extension on the drill. It's just a cheap drill, so what I'll do is you probably before I yeah. Take my drill back off here, and I gotta release it from the. much room and stuff, but this is what it is. Perhaps. I'll take that one off there. Not in the stud, so it's not, not really biting anything. So there we go. Okay. There we go. Flip this around. Here I've got the stud, so it looks like that'll be nice and straight. So slip that back on my drill. Beautiful. 
For now we're in there good and strong. We can take the blind slats, those back down, up and in. Now I may need to follow this up and prepare those deals, but at least we're in stronger. All right. Stronger and hopefully straighter. Looking back at it. Yeah, that's great. Nice and straight. That's how it should be. Let's make sure this end. See, that's a little weak too. It's a little stronger, but a little weak. So let's pull this over. Gonna lock the door so no one opens it on me. Cause yeah, that happens. <coughs> let's open the side of the open a bit. See if that make sure that deals in. Not really in the stud, but this side is not the weight holding side, the other side is, so it's more critical. And the center bracket is in the wood beam. And if it does come really, we can always use a molly. Can put a molly in there. Or can reposition it. This side which is right there. And right there. You hear the nice solid difference. Anyways, done deal. Lines are fixed. As I'm editing the video, I can see on the top left side I need to get back up there and fix the valance. I somehow missed that when I was there. No big deal. Looks like it's just kind of touching the ceiling a little bit. For a much more in-depth article and more information on vertical blinds, just Google Ultimate Vertical Blinds Repair List. And then scroll down to see the KFM blog Skyscraper Repair Link List Post. So a much more informative article on vertical blinds. I hope uh, you like what you see there. A quick search of my YouTube channel, you should be able to find a bunch of material that will be helpful to your maintenance needs and links to tools and parts used in the videos can be found in the descriptions below.